is going on everyone today I'll be reviewing the all new 900 global honey badger intensity the honey badger intensity releases on March the 12th the intensity features the proven grapnel core and has the s70 solid reactive cover since the acquisition of global the strongest ball that I have thrown has been the reality I'm excited to get to throw a ball that fits right below that the honey badger intensity is literally a baby reality as you'll see later in the video, the only difference between the reality and the intensity is that the intensity shapes a little harder off the dry down lane. From the videos, you'll see that the intensity forced me deep into the lane. I can't overstate how strong this ball is. I've noticed that the balls from Global seem very cover dominant. By that I mean the cover really wants to dictate most of the ball motion over the core itself. I really wanted to keep this ball in the oil because the second I got it to the dry, it tended to overhook on me. Don't be discouraged though, after throwing this ball some, I took it to 2000 grit and it really evened out the ball reaction. Here recently some of our dull balls have been coming out of the factory almost chalky, so I encourage all of you to let a ball lane shine before you decide if you like it or not. For the slow speed players or the high rev players, the honey badger intensity could act as the strongest ball in your bag. Since your balls naturally hook more, sometimes you don't need the strongest ball we make, such as reality. For low rev players and high speed players, you'll see this ball slow down really hard in the mid lane. This ball will be good for you during the first game of league. If you're looking for a ball that is useful in longer patterns and higher volume lane conditions, look no further than the Honey Badger Intensity. I compared the Honey Badger Intensity to the Reality and the Rotor Grip Rubicon. As I stated in the earlier segment, the Intensity flat out hooks. It's a baby reality. Because of its motion off of the break point, the intensity forced me further left with my feet than where I would normally stand with the reality. Where the reality wants to go forward off of the dry, the intensity really continues hard from that same spot. The difference probably amounts to th two or three boards on this half shot. If you're a tournament bowler, having both balls is essential, but if you only bowl league a few nights a week, you could get away with having one or the other. I'm really starting to feel like the Rubicon is a shape that needs a specific condition for me. The lanes need to be very flat and pretty hard for my Rubicon to come into play. The Honey Badger for me was more motion all around. It forced me further left on the lane and where the Rubicon blends the drive to the right, the Honey Badger really jumped hard off of it. Thanks for watching. Please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel for future bar review videos. Stop by your local Storm VIP Pro Shop to pre-order your Honey Badger Intensity today.